everybody. Welcome back to my channel, the Lotus Doll Shops Balance Lifestyle Channel. Today, we're just going to be talking about some things that I'm loving. We're going to get started with my Takea Cold Brew Coffee Maker. So first, what you do is you take the filter out of the coffee maker itself, unscrew the top from the filter. It's my favorite kind of coffee there, Community Coffee and Chicory. Then you add the coffee into the filter. Next, you screw the top back onto the filter. Then you add water to the coffee maker itself. I add about three cups. And then you put the filter down into the coffee maker and screw it back on, like so. And then you put it in the fridge and the next morning, someone will hand you some grits, eggs, and bacon, and your cold coffee will be ready. Unscrew the top. Take the filter out and then pour you a nice cool cup of coffee. Delicious. <laughs> That's the Takea cold brew coffee maker available on Amazon. The next thing I'm loving on my things I'm loving is uh, my marble dinnerware set. It's got the bowl which is a pretty good size bowl if you want to do it like a soup if you're doing dinner. It's also got the saucer. Of course, that's, you know, for your salad plate or even you could use it as a dessert plate. And if you've been on my Instagram page at Elvon Love and Life, you've seen this plate a lot because every time I make something delicious, I make sure to post a picture. So you've seen this plate a lot. If you follow me on Instagram, if you don't, go over there and follow me. So that is my marble dinnerware set and it is available on Amazon. It's beautiful and very, very posh. And so next up are my Sudoka wine stoppers. When I saw these guys on Amazon, I knew I had to have them because one of my other wine stoppers has, had got stuck in... Um, our garbage disposal so I had to buy some new ones and this is what they say two of them say why not and the other one says drink me you can see that in my hand I'm gonna show it to you in just a second and they're silicone so they fit tightly on the top of the bottle so your wine will always stay fresh and again if you follow me on Instagram you know, I like a nice glass of wine every now and then. And they were very affordable. Again, that's the Sardoka Wine Stoppers. Really cute. So next on my list of loves is are these satin pillowcases. Now, guys, I got these on Amazon. And I told you guys about them in my Amazon haul video. They are perfect. The quality is good. They don't get scratched up or nicked easily. Look, let me turn them over. That is the zipper beneath them, so they look very, very posh. Um, and I like it that my hair doesn't dry out, I don't sweat on them, and they are very, very well made. And of course, you know, hey, they work really well uh, with our bedding sets. I wanted something gold, but they have like, I believe, God, a good bunch of colors from this particular brand. Again, they're on Amazon. And these are my silk pillowcases. And like I said, they had them in many different colors and they work very well with my bedding. So if you're looking for something to help your hair stay moisturized, that's Now guys, if you watch my Valentine's Day vlog, you will see I love these floor pillows. I got these from Home Goods. They're by a company called Urban 86, I believe. And they've got a little handle on them so you can drag them all over the floor. And my thumbnail picture, I'm sitting on them. They are very comfortable, very nice. And um, these were made in India. So they're really detailed and they just fit my decor so well. I'm going to pull up a little closer so you can kind of see the detail on them. They are beautiful. And again, they were very affordable. Um, home goods, I think they were like $29.99 each. If you're the type of person who likes to sit on the floor and watch a movie or lay on the floor, you know, they're perfect for your living room. They are beautiful. 
first I want to show you guys some of my favorite foods that I love. This is the kettle brewed green and white tea from Trader Joe's. Now, this is unsweetened because normally we would get the, uh, I believe it was uh, Arizona Diet Sweet Tea from Walmart, but we found this one and we love it. It is bitter, but there's a mint to it. And when you put a little swig of fresh lemon in it, it just it just tastes so good. It's so refreshing. So Andre is in love with this one now too. Um, I introduced him to this one after I went to Trader Joe's and I was just looking around. So um, yes, this is everything is all natural. Again, it's unsweetened green and white tea. Very very good for your body and very very good for cold and flu season. So the next thing is our, in our food items are this el is this elderberry tea. <laughs> Um, this tea is very good to support your immune system. And of course, you guys know I have lupus, so I'm looking for anything that'll help support my immune system. And because we're in cold and flu season, and also many people are trying to avoid anything that has to do with sickness because of COVID, this is a great tea to try. Now, it doesn't taste very good, but you can add as much honey as you want and try to do at least two cups a week consistently and this will definitely help boost your immune system. Other than washing our hands and you know making sure we sanitize around the house and wherever we go, um, this is perfect. It's just what you need uh, to survive the cold and flu season. Give it a shot. The next thing on my list is this Freak Show Michael David Winery Cabernet Sauvignon. Now, normally I'm a red blend girl because I like the blends of the different wines. I normally wouldn't even drink Cab by itself, but this wine is so good. It's very smooth, it's very fruity, and the tannins are low, so um, the alcohol content is not that strong. It's a very smooth drink, so if you're into trying some new wines, the Cabernet Sauvignon, this Freak Show wine is very, very good. Again, that's by the Michael David Winery, and I'm sure you can go to any bottle store in your city and, you know, ask around about this. I was recommended this by the wine store owner, so it's delicious, and I'm loving this um, artwork. <laughs> it's fun. I enjoyed it. Try it, guys. So the next thing on my list is this chili lime seasoning blend from Trader Joe's. I love this stuff. Um, you can use it to season rice. You can put it in your tacos. You can make a uh, ranch sauce or anything like that. It just gives it a good smoky flavor and it's just a little bit spicy. It's got red peppers, green peppers, a little sea salt, citric acid. It's very, very basic, but it is actually very, very delicious. So if you're looking for a new seasoning, this one is one that's good to have in your pantry. Um, you can also um, put it on meat. So check this one out. Delicious. So next up is this Herbs of Provence Extra Virgin Olive Oil. This stuff is Wow. I put it on my turkey bacon when I'm frying it. I'll put it in some lemon garlic pasta. You can put it on top of a roast chicken. You can do some chicken thighs with it. There's so much that you can do. The possibilities are endless. Any recipe, you can shake it up like that, see? Mm-hmm. Those are all the herbs. Normally, I'll buy the herbs for Provence alone and just sprinkle it on whatever, but this is genius. And again, guys, this is from Trader Joe's as well. I am loving this, and I think I showed you this in the Trader Joe's haul. It's sourced from one country, France. That's the best kind of olive oil, guys, if you don't know, and packed in Spain. So it's delicious, it's fragrant, and it really adds a good flavor to whatever foods. If you're looking for herbs and oil, this is it. Trader Joe's Herbs of Provence. Next on my list are these gooseberries. They are so delicious. I found these over at Trader Joe's as well. They are vitamin C packed, um, full of fiber. It helps with insomnia. They're anti-cancer, antioxidant. It's good for your teeth, your heart, and it's also good for your hair. Prevents dandruff. It's a natural conditioner and also premature grain. 
This is what they look like. They are delicious. Uh, it's a little tart, a little sweet. It's like a little orange, <laughs> so to speak. So I'm about to pop these two guys right in my mouth. Thank you guys so much for watching Things That I Love. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell, and give me a thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Bye.